Mikhail Khodorkovsky was one of Russia's richest and most influential men. But his supporters say by mixing business with politics, he found himself behind bars. Now, in protest against a ruling to extend his detention ahead of a new trial, Khodorkovsky has gone on hunger strike. The ruling says Khodorkovsky violates recent changes to Russian law approved by President Dmitry Medvedev. He's vowed to go on protesting until Medvedev confirms he's aware of the situation. Since you cannot achieve anything with illegal means, the man is forced to take such a step. And we hope that this message, albeit delivered in such an extreme way, will be finally heard and that this will not affect the state of our defendant. Khodorkovsky is already serving an eight-year sentence on charges of tax evasion and fraud. But earlier this month, this Moscow court extended that sentence by a further three months in a new trial that could see him behind bars for 22 years on charges of money laundering and theft. Khodorkovsky's supporters have repeatedly staged protests outside of the court hearings. They say the case is politically motivated, part of a state crackdown on opponents of former president turned prime minister Vladimir Putin. Khodorkovsky was once head of Russia's second biggest oil company. It used to pump one in every five barrels in Russia produced. The Russian government insists Khodorkovsky committed massive financial crimes to acquire his fortune. But now left with nothing, Khodorkovsky is prepared to go to extremes, even to the point of death, in his struggle for justice.